Hello, my name is Corey Heyer. I'm the executive chef at the Bernard's Inn, and today we're going to do a roasted butternut squash soup with blue cheese and apples. We're going to roast the butternut squash. Uh, we're going to cut this in half, remove the seeds, we'll brush it with a little bit of olive oil, and then we're going to bake it in a 350 degree oven for about 45 minutes. When there's about 15 minutes left, we're going to sprinkle a little cinnamon and a little honey on top. It's going to bring out the sugars and give the butternut squash soup some complexity. While the squash is in the oven, we're going to start the base for the soup, which is going to be sweating some onions and butter. And then about halfway through the simmering process, we're going to add some apples. Decided to use Macintosh apples in the soup itself. They have a very nice sweetness. Uh, I've left the apples quartered so that they don't cook too quickly. And then we're going to add some thyme, some cold water, some salt. After you've added your quart of water and brought the soup up to a simmer, turn it down and add a half cup of heavy cream. And then when the soup is done, we're going to scoop out the roasted butternut squash, add it to our base, puree it in a blender, and then we're going to top it with some blue cheese, some chives, and some julienne of Granny Smith apple. The uh, Granny Smith apple has a little bit of tartness to it, so it's going to give uh, a nice freshness to the soup at the end, where the soup base is going to be very rustic, and rich in its flavor from the roasted flavors of the honey and cinnamon. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much.